Welcome back to the channel, guys. Um, today I'm going to be installing these puddle lights that I picked up. Uh, there's five for each side. I had the underglow, but I think I'm going to go with the puddle lights. So I don't know how I'm going to install them yet because my car is low. You could install them actually like that up, or you could make a hole and then face them down. So this is how they look. So I picked up that. It comes with a double sided tape and some little screws. I picked up that up on eBay and I also picked up the switch on eBay. I think it was like $8. So I was trying to figure out how to connect it and I, I figured it out already. And I'm going to show you how I, I connect it. These are the new switches they've been coming out with. Uh, they're pretty cool because you push it in and the light turns on and you push it out and the light goes off. So these are good because I'm going to connect this straight to the battery and just turn them on whenever I want and um, turn them off whenever I want. So, this brown one right here, you're not gonna use it. It comes with all these wires, it's kind of confusing. I, I, I had it, I was confused, I couldn't get it to work, but it's because I didn't have the switch in right in the proper slots where it's supposed to go out, because you could actually disconnect it. You have to make sure you put it in the right slot. So like that. And then, um. So this one. All right, so the switch is going to have a negative. This is going to be the negative. I already have them connected to the battery here. I'm going to connect the negative to here. The positive is going to go to the white one from the battery. And then the ones from the from the LEDs or I mean these puddle lights, the negative is gonna go to the, the battery. And then these two are gonna go connect together. These are gonna go straight to the switch. I mean to the, sorry. They're gonna go straight to the puddle lights for the positive, the red wire, puddle lights. So this is gonna be the out. Connect these two, the blue one and the red one to the out, to the puddle lights. The white one main, to the main battery. The black one to the negative. So now you got your switch right here. And you press the switch, illuminates. Turn down the lights, you press it. So that way you know that they're on. So that's how I'm gonna connect it. going to be directly to the battery so now I have um, some, some wire that I had bought a while back it's I think it's a 10 gauge or 16 gauge so these are going to go underneath the car I don't know how I want to put them yet you could either put them on the bottom but since my car is so low I probably end up ripping them off the ground when I air out so I'm going to make maybe make a hole on the side skirt and then put them into the top but i don't want to take off my side skirt so i'm not sure how i'm going to do it yet but it's giving you an idea how to connect this switch which is really nice you set this element on amazon with led so this brown one is not going to go connected to anything just like that This switch I'm gonna put in the inside. I already have the place where I'm gonna put it. It's gonna go where I had the air cups. So the switch is gonna be installed right here. I already made the hole. I had that when I did the air cups on my car. So for the bottom, it would be ideal to do it like this. <clears throat> to do it like this, make a hole and just put the, the puddle light to the bottom. Um, but we have to put the screw through the top down. So in order for me to do that, I have to take off the side skirt and install them properly. But for today, what I want to do is just gonna stick them on there. And hopefully when I air out, they don't hit the ground. Um, so it's just uh, for a temporary uh, 
See how it looks? I'm thinking of putting it right there where it's at right there, right in the middle of the side skirt. Um, I already measured the, the whole side skirt. I got the center. So we got five lights. So we're gonna go the middle one here, the number five and be in the middle and then two to the, each side. So this is what I did. <clears throat> I found the center. See how low, I hope it, it's gonna hit the ground probably. So I found the center, put the middle one, the fifth one in the middle and then I went all the way back and put the rest. This is just temporary. I'm just gonna see how it looks. <clears throat> so if I wanna install them properly, I have to take off the side skirt, make the hole, pass the, put a light through the bottom to the, to the top to the bottom, put the screw from the top to the bottom. And I just put this tape right here so the wire won't be dangling. So that's how I did it. And I'll um, see how it looks later on in the night when I try it. Okay, so white battery, straight to the battery. Black, straight to the ground with the negative of the puddle lights. And then the positive of the puddle lights to the blue and the red. So the switch is off right there. You press the switch, turns on. Puddle lights are on. So now I just have to run the wire and see we'll put the switch on all right so what i'm gonna do i'm only gonna run the red one to the switch and then the the ground one this one i'm, I'm not gonna run it all the way to the, to the top i'm just gonna run it anywhere you have metal to connect it so i will look at that right here i'm looking at it right here on this on this um, screw I could just connect it there as long as it's grounded that's how you need so I'm gonna ground it anywhere so the only one I'm gonna run up to the battery is gonna be the, the red one the black one I'm gonna run it to anywhere that's ground same to both sides so the way that I ran the the wire I just got a hanger connected the, the wire that I wanted to and I just fished it all the way down to the bottom And then I'm gonna grab it down there. So like I was saying now, what I'm gonna, what's gonna be, it's only gonna be one wire coming up to the top. The ground wire is gonna be grounded by the bottom of the chassis. So that's how I put it, put it right there. All right, so I installed the switch right there. And then, um, oh, this, all you, this, all you have to do is pull this down and it comes out. And then the, um, the ground, I'm gonna put it right here. Do the screw right here, this one. So I'm, I put the ground for the switch here. And then I ran only two wires to the front, which are the, the hot wire straight from the battery and the wire that makes the light turn on. And that's it. All right, so now that I put the ground on, the light illuminates and then it turns on and the lights. So. That's gonna be the end of the video um i'm gonna end up putting the puddle lights inside the side skirts i already bought the things that i have to do with it so yeah just press it in there puddle lights are on 
So I already bought the drill bits that I need to make the hole to put the, the puddle lights inside the, the side skirt. But I think I'm gonna make that on a different video. I, I didn't have any time on, on these days off that I have. I didn't have time to do it. Uh, so, so I bought this Harbinger Freight. So I'm gonna make the hole, put the puddle light inside. I'm gonna do that in another video. So the way that I did it right now is just, uh, just basics, you know. Um, the way you, you could do it if your car is not lowered. But since my car is gonna be all the way to the ground, Last night I lowered it and it, and the puddle light was hitting the ground. So, and I think um, I'm gonna like them better when they're inside. That way they can just shine the light down. Cause right now you can see the light from the sides of the puddle lights. You can see the light like from the side. Well, if they're inside, they'll just be shining down which is gonna make them look much better. All right, thanks for watching. Um, subscribe, like, and share. Follow me on Instagram. And I hope this was like a little bit informative for you. Uh, if you like what you see and you learn something, um, subscribe to my channel. And so this is just like, this is demonstration or some guidelines of how to install a switch and the wiring, you know. Hope um, it was helpful. She is in the night. Looking pretty good. Sounds like my right height right there.